Welcome to my lovely sacred space. I am Francisco and in this video I will give you a few ideas to celebrate in bulk, also known as Bridges Day, the first light. Celtic people celebrated these holidays by lighting candles and fires. It's a day of purification, of growing light, and the days begin to grow in length, so we celebrate the sun. This is the midpoint between the winter solstice and the spring equinox. This holiday is also known as Bridget's Day. When Ireland was Christianized, the pagan goddess Bridge became Saint Bridget. In Irish mythology, she is credited with giving written word to humanity, and she is the goddess of fire and flame, of change, of poetry, of inspiration, transformation, wisdom, metalworking, healing, creativity, water, sacred wells, prophecies, and more. So there we have a lot of inspiration to craft our holiday ritual today. Imbolc is one of the fire festivals in the wheel of the year, so it's important to light some kind of fire. Imbolc represents the sun, the light at the end of the tunnel after the winter. This is the birth of the spring. It's a small light, so it makes sense to light candles rather than torches or bonfires. There's also an Imbolc tradition of opening all the doors in the home and the windows and standing at the doorway to receive bridge blessings. If you live near a sacred well, you can visit and leave an offering. I have prepared a symbolic ritual with a glass of water instead that we can do at home. You can find it below the video. Another kind of offering would be an artistic offering. So in bulk is a good time to make crafts that have a connection with divinity. I found these rushes and made a Bridget's cross. The cross is a solar symbol and represents fire. It's prepared on in bulk and these crosses are left outside in the hopes that they will be blessed by bridge. The blessed crosses are then hung in the home for protection. If you like to make candles, this is also a great time to do just that. Candles made on in bulk have a very special energy. Some people spend most of this day just making candles. I decided to make a glass candle with this printable sticker that I will include in the link below. You can also bless all the candles that you're going to use this year. Divinations are typically enhanced on the Sabbath because these are the days of transition between one season and the next. I have left some tips in the flickering magic or reading candles topic in the spellsite forum with possible interpretations and also this page for candle reading. Cast a circle in the name of Bridge and the Sun God who grows within her belly. After all, one translation of Imbolic is in the belly, which represents the fertility and the rebirth of the sun. So how to decorate the altar? In this season, we use colors that represent spring, such as pink, yellow, blue, white, and green. We can add vessels of water, stones, seeds, crosses or solar symbols, and of course, candles. There are a few more ideas in this grimoire page with correspondences and offerings. When it comes to food, anything related to milk like cheese, yogurt, butter, also bread, seeds, and root vegetables like potatoes. If you can, make a bonfire and burn some juniper or dandelion, the sacred plants of the winter season. Cleanse and purify yourself with the smoke. Honor the elements and get in touch with nature. Go out for a hike or for a walk, even lay in your backyard and look at the stars. For more ideas, visit the forum in the link below, and I hope to see you there. Thanks for watching and your support. Have a very wonderful, blessed inbox.